Hello! Welcome back. Um, it's been a while. I've been working mostly in secret on the uh, secret underworld skunkworks style project. It's uh, finally come to fruition and it works. Yay. So what I'm going to do now is show you what I've been doing. Welcome to the Beast. So here we have the original block that I was using with the uh, turbo setup. Um, this is the one you'd have seen me changing the cam in. So across the back here, I've got the MED RS cam. On top of it, I've placed a alloy seven port Pierce head. Now, this this head is. Always a bit controversial because there have been some serious issues with quality. However, this particular head was the first into the country, or the first at least sold by Webcon, um, that was actually cast by Edelbrock in the US. Now, uh, you will see uh, the likes of uh, Specialist Components now um, have just started to sell this head, weirdly, with these exact uh, throttle bodies on from Genvy. Uh, this is not a setup from Specialist, Com Specialist Components. This is my own kit. I actually bought these throttle bodies to put on my Lotus um, three years ago, but the Lotus still hasn't been built, so I'll put them on here for now. Um, there is an amount of make going off, obviously. So... This device here, because I'm running the speed winner that you'll have seen in a previous episode as the ECU, it requires, or at least it likes to have, a manifold air pressure signal, um, as well as this, of course, being my fuel pressure regulator, which regulates the fuel to this rail. This needs to regulate to three psi, sorry, three bar above manifold pressure. So again, I need some kind of reference, and the only way I can get this reference is to drill into each of these areas, insert a small little rod, and attach these tubes into this four to one manifold. Yeah, works well, does the job nicely. Uh, what else have we got? Now I did have, uh, a, few, a few of you will probably have already seen this, I did have on there a set of um, 1.5 rockers. However, one decided to uh, come off, which you know wasn't wasn't a good thing. So right now I've got a set of standard rockers on there, which may well snap because I've had one snap before, uh, as the the valve springs are fairly strong on this head. Otherwise, um, down here we have a, I think this is a VW smart coil. This um, was recommended by the uh, Mega Squirt slash Speedwino crew as, as the one to go for, so does the job. And uh, it's got a built-in driver, so absolutely spot on. Four wires straight from the ECU, boom. These... Um, these HT leads. I spent a while trying to find a set of HT leads that would suit this setup properly. Weirdly, the set that I ended up with are actually uh, an MPI mini set. They just happen to line up properly. And on the on the on the on the MPI, the coils here. However, due to the placement of these plugs, which are underneath the uh, throttle bodies. They just happen to be absolutely 100% spot on. So, boom. Um, what I'm going to do now is just cut. I'm going to cut to tomorrow. 